That's the Wilbur Chocolate Factory out here in Lidditz. This is the Wilbur Chocolate Factory. They have a chocolate museum here. Behind me are the tools that were used to hand make all the chocolate here in the Wilbur Chocolate Factory. That's before they automated the factory. Hello, Lisa. Would you like to sample? Oh, let me try that. Wilbur chocolate? Mmm, very nice. Mm. Delicious chocolate. Absolutely amazing. Mm. Fresh and homemade right here in the Wilbur factory in Lidditz, Pennsylvania. Wilbur Chocolate Factory. That was a dark one. That is a milk chocolate. Oh, milk chocolate. Mmm. Delicious. Excellent. Mmm. <laughs> now behind me, before the factory was automated, they would hand make the chocolate using these molds. These are handmade molds. And the chocolate would be poured into the mold, allowed to cool and harden. It was a very, very tedious and long process. These are some of the molds that they made the chocolate bars from. For all you chocolate lovers, this is a step back in time. Here are the molds from the 1800s. It's a wonderful place to come. Bring your family. Buy some chocolate. Come in the museum. Some of the old canisters dating back to the 1800s where they would put chocolate in the canister and sell them. I also noticed that they have other companies here like Hershey. There's the old Hershey canisters. This was an old grinding machine used to grind the cocoa seeds in order to make the chocolate. Sorry about that. Just as they've done for many generations. This is some of the chocolate they sell here. Experienced farmers carefully select the pods that are ready for harvesting. Pods ripen throughout the year since the growing season in the tropics is continuous. They have on display some of the old canisters that were used from the early 1800s until now. These canisters were used to store the chocolate. The Wilbur Chocolate Company.